Just jump right in. Boom. So that last deck I played, I wonder if it'd be better on paper. Um, I'm not sure what it was, if it was the deck itself. Man, what do I even need with this deck? Oh, <laughs> so I got Thought Seizes, Collective Vitality, Dark Ritual. I can dump that dude's hand in one turn. Uh, I'm going to keep this because if I get one... No, I have no reanimation spells. Well, again. This isn't bad. Yeah, it's not bad at all. Okay. Because these can get the counter spells out of his hand. I just need a uh, loot to a reanimation spell and I can entomb. So let's keep this. Um, I'll put them in the bottom. I'm going to fetch for a mountain. Uh, where are we? A mountain. Faith is looting. Why does this come all the way over here? Walking Ballista. <laughs> I'm, I'm actually going to toss that dude into the yard. As well as the swamp. Yep. F6. This deck is going to require my opponent to think a whole lot more than I than I will. Well, no, that's not true. When the time comes to actually start comboing, it's going to get really complicated. All right, he's holding that up. All right, dance with it. Well, I don't have the combo going, so... Wait a second. I can entomb... and start doing the combo. Actually, I can do this next... Uh, reels it to their hand. Let's see what you got, buddy. Hopefully, you have a million counter spells. Don't brainstorm. <laughs> oh, it's gonna do it again. So this can go ahead and I can entomb and get the world gorger. Try to go infinite on a mana, and then at the end, uh. Use this on the walking ballista. God, that's so much text. <laughs> Hold on a second. Is it uh Yeah, good luck with that. That thing had to use two different <laughs> All right, so this is um check pile. What do I not want him to have? I guess it's the bolt. I don't want to have the bolt. The rest I don't care about. Or do I? Yeah, I don't want you to have the bolt. Um. So he had the Snapcast of Mage and the Leobold. So he still has ways to get through this. So that means I can... I can go in and cast his faith is looting. Uh, he might run freaking wastelands because every once in a while they do, they run them. Cast his faith is looting. Jeez, I even got K commands. This is you may cash nigga. Okay, so <laughs> how do I want to do this? Um, I can, so this K command is gone. That's gonna be discarded. And Tomb has to get what I, what the, the creature, so I can't get rid of that. I need the brutality, so I think it's still better to have the Dance of the Dead. So I just drew two from there and did nothing with them. So he's going to have Snap Brainstorm, though. All right, because he did the Bloodstain Wire. Yeah, he's going to have Snap Brainstorm. And he can pitch Leovold. If he casts Leovold, I can Brutality him.
Yep, there goes that. You're going to cast Leoval, then have Force of Will back up. So what that does is it lets me Brutality you. Um, and try to get that. So I'm still working on the Walking Ballista kill, which is going to be really awkward. But it doesn't matter. He can draw a billion cards. I don't care. I need him to not draw another spell after this. That's the problem here. Yeah, I need to draw another, uh, not draw another spell. Yeah, that's fine. I mean, that spell, another counter spell. If he gets him, it's going to be bad. So it was a force of will. He does have a ponder, though. And he could snap brainstorm to try to get to it. So hold on, let me screenshot this. So I'm gonna take this force of will. And then I'm gonna entomb right now. Yeah, I'm gonna entomb right now. Just so that you can't stop it. Get a world gorger. <laughs> now the problem is that when I get all my mana, he can try to K command. Well, actually that doesn't that doesn't work because whatever he tries to do to kill the freaking um the walking ballista, it's not gonna it's not gonna matter. Alright, let's see if he shuffles. Man, this is like, that's why I don't like using this because it gets confusing. He chose not to shuffle. Uh, I took the force. He used the ponder. He's now fetching. He's going to cast Brainstorm. Jesus Christ. He went from Snap, Death Rite, and 2K commands. So now I don't know what he has. I guess I could still go for it. Well, now I have to go for it. Yeah, he saw a lot of cards. But I don't think it matters. I think I have to go for it. That why weren't you out forever ago? Um let's go with the world gorger. I'm going to say you didn't get that force. Well, I can't auto yield that one. This one I can. That one I can too. Uh, please stay open. <laughs> Is my opponent going, what is happening now? <laughs> is he trying to read this card? Is that what happened? <laughs> is that what it is? With three lands, it makes it's actually not going to take forever. My opponent trying to figure out, yeah, 
<laughs> he just figured it out. <laughs> All right, so what? He's going to bring surgicals in. That's a given. He's going to bring surgicals. I can bring in my own surgicals, I guess, but there's Pyroblast. Uh, I have not the slightest clue how to sideboard with this deck. <laughs> um, Liliana's good? I, I don't know. I'm just going to go with Blood Moon to Pyroblast. That seems good. Seems good to me. All right. Uh, if I really wanted to, I think I could put in Liliana's and Blood Moons and Pyroblast and like take out the combo and just try to reanimate either Grizzle Brands or uh, Ona's Queen of Fae. I'm going to actually take these out because of K Command. Um. So winning from that spot, Dance of the Dead. So first off, if I have no other creatures in the yard, it's an infinite loop and the game is over, right? And I can't stop it. But since Walking Ballista is in the yard, Dance of the Dead is the only uh, enchantment, reanimation enchantment that I have, that enchanted creature gets plus one, plus one, and doesn't untap during his controller's untap step. So in other words, I can reanimate Walking Ballista and he'll be a plus one, plus one. Then I can use all that mana to just give him a crap ton of counters and machine gun my opponent. I either win with this, win with a Ribbons, because this is an X spell, um, exile the entire library with Ona, or um, if I have Sunscourt's Desert out, I keep doing an infinite mana, and then I just get rid of, uh, I ping him to death with Sunscourt's Desert. Uh, let's see, so four cards. I think I'm going to get rid of one of those. I'll get rid of... Actually, these therapies don't seem that good. I'm going to get rid of the therapies. Yeah, this seems good. <laughs> this deck is so stupid. <laughs> it's so dumb. <laughs> this is uh, this is the first deck I would run if... Uh... Well, actually, you know what? I might run this in like in... Uh... I thought that was a freaking dark ritual. I'm about to say, yo. I'm going to keep because I can turn through this. I thought this was a ritual because then I can go swamp and then turn to swamp freaking make you regret life. Get a non-basic. Yeah. <laughs> Death right? Yeah. Um... I can make him use his mana. No, I don't think I want to do that. Let's go with that. <coughs> I mean, you got to hold that up because I can entomb. Or are you not going to do that? Are you going to hit me? Uh, I think that's fine. I think I want to keep all these cards because if I if he doesn't get rid of the Blood Moon, I could just use it. Sure. He got rid of my Badlands, though. That's kind of annoying. And yeah, Drew Pyro Blast is great. Um, do you want to play this Walking Ballista on one? No, that doesn't do anything for me. He could snap him me. The good news is, the deck I'm playing against is super slow. So if you give me all the time in the world, because this is okay, I I have to use my graveyard. I guess I get like Dark Ritual or freaking Grizzlebrand out. Strix? Shh. Mm, yeah, sure. I can't do anything about it anyway. Uh, hmm. What I want to do here, I would like him to use his mana, but I think it's going to go ahead and try to drop the Blood Moon right now. He's got to counter this or fetch and get his island.
Are you going to brainstorm fetch? This is when I pitch a Simeon Spirit Guide and pyroblast that. <laughs> Does it resolve? Oh, you need to fetch. Yeah. <laughs> Why am I even F2ing? F6. You do whatever you want. Yeah, it, I mean, I guess it doesn't resolve because he went and got. What? That's confusing. That's really confusing. Yeah, that's super confusing. Um, I don't want to throw in the yard anything too. <laughs> um, I think I'm gonna get rid of this power blast because I have two thought these thought seizes. Is What are you gonna surgical, bro? Yeah, I don't care about any of that. Uh, I guess I can get your edict. You can edict, my dude. Guess I had your blast, power blast. Um, yeah, I don't care about any of this. Um, but let me get the edict. Yeah, if you would have got the underground scene and then hydro blasted it, that would have been amazing. Um, but that didn't happen. Um, do I want to get anything else out of his hand? No, no I don't want to do that. Uh, yeah, he's kind of stuck. I thought he'd have um, surgical. Now I just need a reanimation spell. I can reanimate freaking um, Grizzlebrand. He's getting a land. He's gonna uh, cast a Snapcast the Mage to just increase the clock. Okay. Sure. <sighs> uh, I'm gonna act like he doesn't have Surgical and I'm gonna go ahead and Entomb. Uh, I can Entomb World Gorger. That should be fine right now. Because uh, if he surgicals World Gorger, I still have a few other options. Um, actually, yeah, it's going to be World Gorger. Again, if he surgicals it, don't care. Um, one, two, three, four. Jeez. Jeez, this is a beating. <laughs> this is a beating. Um, uh, not the fucking return. It's destroy target artifact and deal two. That's dead. And then I'm going to ping the freaking Snapcaster Mage. So... That's a beating. <clears throat> you have no mana and you have a Snapcast Mage out. Uh, so I have the combo. Him and Jace, uh, sure. This deck is stupid. <laughs> yeah, holy crap, we've won. <laughs> we've won. That's 